Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to recreate 13 Wishes, 13 Wishes Gigi's hairstyle since I did do a poll like what yesterday, the time filming this, if you guys wanted a video on how to recreate it since I know that I think there's only like one video um, on YouTube. That was the only one I could find when trying to see for this video. Like I've done it before but I can find any other like tutorials. It wasn't even like a, tor a tutorial, just cleaning a GG up. But I'm gonna show you guys how to recreate it and also going to show you first what you're gonna need. So first up, GG. <laughs> and you're also gonna need this. This is the most crucial part that you're gonna need. And this basically like makes the hairstyle. So you're gonna need that. I'm sure if you maybe don't have this piece, you could even just get a bit of like paper and try and scrunch it up or something. I'm not sure how much they sell for online, but yeah. You're also going to need at least three elastic bands. So I have my packet of elastic bands here. So yeah, I'm probably going to try with my camera a bit more down so you guys can see more what I'm doing a bit easier while I talk through steps. So let me just move my camera really quick. Okay, so I've now fixed the camera angle. I think you guys can see a bit better on how to do it. So I'm just going to... I may do this a few times, hopefully it's not going to be too bad. But I'm just going to quickly brush her hair. Mine is like pretty, like not that glowy since I have had her for a while. So I have like recreated her hairstyle a few times and also like just cleaned her up. This is actually my childhood Gigi. And for some reason, she has like the worst limbs ever. Like see when I try to sit her down. Like what is that? Like she just can't sit. It's really weird. So I'd love to get another Gigi. I don't know what that is about her. That's like wrong. <laughs> but yeah. So first thing you're going to want to do. Just get elastic and do a high ponytail. So just get all the hair and make sure it's like not too mixed. You can like already see like the bubble mark. Not the mark. I don't know. Like crimp I guess. I don't know. And all you want to do is, after you've got it like this, is just tie it up into a high ponytail. Sorry if, like, it's not a great angle, but this part is just basically doing a ponytail, so... At least go round maybe three times. And there we go, we've got the ponytail look. It looks so clean, look at that. Ta-da! So, as you can see, we've kind of got a first step. Also, this is what Gigi looks like with a ponytail. She looks really pretty with one, to be honest. Maybe not the best angle, but she looks really pretty. Also, Gigi with her hair done also looks amazing, just saying. <laughs> now, this is the kind of part where I think it's probably the hardest. And I did have to recreate this. I, f I did have to. This took multiple attempts. The first time I done it. So I'm just going to get like two elastics out. Also this is so long. I really want to get more of these. I remember when they nearly melted on me. Because I was in like a hot country. And I brought them with me. And then like I picked it up. And it was all like gooey. So I had to quickly bring it inside. But that's the story of my elastic bands nearly mel melting on me. Anyway. <laughs> Back to her hair. It's kind of hard angle. I may need to get a stand or something. So she doesn't keep moving. Because if you don't know. Like this is like the best technique. I may do that even. Would that be? I think you guys can see that. So I'm doing the knee technique. I think we've all done this. All you want to do is just get a little piece and the big side is going to go, the big side, let me show. That's like such, what am I doing? That's such a bad angle. <laughs> the big side is going to go like nearer her head and the smaller bit is going to go like at the end of her hair. Even just look at the stock photos, you can see that. But all you want to do is just kind of like separate the ponytail. Also, I'll answer any questions in the comments and also put it like in the description because I know this might not be the best angle or might get a little confusing. Should I fix the angle for this? Can you guys see that okay? I might fix the angle. That's really dumb. 
Okay, so I think that should be a better angle. <laughs> a little bit more awkward for me, but like, as long as you guys can see it a bit better. Um, it's kind of hard to get the hair a bit wet, but I can't really be bothered wetting it, so even just spraying the hair. But I want to do is just kind of do this and start splitting the hair. And then just put it in the centre of the thingy. Lift the hair up. And just kind of keep hiding it, like, so you can't see it. I'm going to brush it a bit. <laughs> Oh my god, my hair's like so tuggy. <laughs> Why did I bring this brush? I'm gonna brush a comb thing for the OMGs. So as you can see, that is hidden, right? Oh my god, it's getting elastic. If I can see one, it was fun fact on the floor. So you will be able to feel like where the line is because there's like a kind of line bit <laughs> in it. And all you want to do is just start tying around it like this and you can see like the shape coming together this may take a few tr attempts by the way so if you don't get it first try like don't worry about it like the only reason i can do it like kind of decent first try for these is just because i've done it a few times because i've taken our hair down and i've recreated it so that's the first one the first kind of bump in our hair which oh my god I remember when I was younger though, I was so curious like how they done this hairstyle myself that I actually like done that and then realised I like messed up my hairstyle super bad. Okay, I had to check that you guys could actually see the camera there because I can't see the camera. So I had to check that. But no, I'll add a picture of how I found my Gigi when like when I first found her again. Cause she was in quite the condition. Well at least her hair was, but even her face is kinda dirty. So this part is kind of, it depends how you want to do the top part to be honest for this, but I'll do it a different way than I maybe normally would, just in case you want to do it differently. But what I normally would do is just tie the first bit, just like this. I might do that, okay I'm going to do it differently than I maybe normally would. So depending on how you want her hair, Oops, this is kind of like squint. <laughs> Again, it may take a few tries, but it doesn't need to be perfect like, in my eyes, to be honest. But as you can see, the hair is like doing this little floppy thing. And it depends what you want it to be. Like, you could obviously try and gel it down just so you maybe like it like that. It just depends on how you like Gigi's hair. I personally like it kind of attached to her head. So I'm just going to quickly brush this little bit down and then show you guys how to attach it kind of to the hairstyle so it won't move anymore i'm not gonna gel it, gel it or anything but if you guys have gel and maybe want to do that and make it a bit more um closer to the stock photo i guess just need to get an elastic also sorry for like really bad lighting like it's really dull today i remember like i took a picture of one of my dolls on instagram and then i took like for at daytime for the first time ever and then I took one at night after that picture and it looks so much more dark <laughs> so anyway back to this back to UG. so you could like obviously twist it and all that and try and keep it but I personally just like to see it's kind of already going a kind of way the way it's been sat for years I personally just like getting a rubber band and just kind of putting it on top just like that again it's all down to preference anyways guys this is finally Gigi's hairstyle doesn't move of course you guys can maybe spend a bit longer on it um I've done it in a few minutes kind of quickly just try to show the show how to do it um again this may take a few tries so try not get frustrated and I do recommend like spraying your hair with water even that will probably help a lot more and if you guys and if your Gigi does have glowy hair mine doesn't but if you guys do and maybe want it gone I do have a video on getting rid of glow seepage I have two I will link one of them down in the description below if you guys want to check it out but no this is how to recreate Gigi's hairstyle again I'll be answering any questions in the comments of this video and I should have steps in the description just in case I wasn't clear because I can definitely see me looking back in this and editing 
and seeing that I don't make this very clear, maybe one of the steps. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you have a great day. Bye.